welcome to the casting party. The idea here is for uh, people out there to see uh, actors, see what they're doing in their lives, and to try to be uh, a little bit conversational about it and not so much hard sell. So take a look at some of these people. They're talented people here, and they want to meet you. So, tell me what's up. Oh, well, my name's John Paul Sutliff. Uh, right now I'm represented by Elise Marshall, and I'm starting a nationwide tour with the National Repertory Theatre Company of America, and that'll start in mid-July. In the mid-time, I'm going to see what I can do about landing some commercials and going out on some submissions, some auditions, and hopefully we can do some work before the tour date starts. Sounds busy. Yeah, I'm taking care of myself, but I'm looking forward to it, and uh, right now I'm hopefully I'll be able to go ahead and do some more work with my band, too. Right now I'm what kind of band? Well, I'm an electric bass player who arranges for session players to go ahead and get together on short notice. Uh, my, my headliner is the John Paul Sutliff Band, and we're doing a recording session this coming Thursday. And we'll Want to join everybody out there to just come right down? and? Oh, well, you know, it's a closed uh, recording <laughs> session. Well, I'd love to, you know, for a future club date or what have you. But right now I'm going to be recording an original tune that I composed and uh, hopefully do some more composing while I'm on the road, too. Great. Sounds busy. Have fun with the tour. Break a leg. Thank you. I will. Break a couple legs. Hey, Catherine. We never get to talk to you. Hey, my main man. Slate for us, won't you? My name is Catherine Denise Law. I'm a singer-songwriter. I'm a producer of Public Access TV. I'm a poet. I'm a lyricist. I'm a studio singer. And... And a conversationalist. I'm a coordinator of events, like um, Venice Beach Lovin' that's happening this June. Oh, that's right. Tell us a little bit about it. Well, it's just a jam session. It's, you know, it's a heal the city thing. And it's going to be a beautiful event. It's going to be at Venice Beach uh, the first Saturday of June. And we hope everybody comes down. It's, you know, totally a, a Lovin' free. It's free. You know, no cover charge, all that stuff. No, I don't honestly know the answer to this question. How did you get the idea for this, for the casting yeah. channel? For the casting channel, um, originally I was thinking I wanted to put headshots on TV. I thought it'd be a great publicity stunt. <laughs> I mean, I heard about some guy who, who got a helicopter and uh, flew, you know, out to Bel Air or somewhere and landed on some agent's back lawn just to hand deliver his headshot. And I thought publicity stunts—that's great. So that's what it's all about, man. Thanks, Chris. Come tell me, what's up? Well, let's see, I've been doing a little acting, and, uh, Give me your name. Chris, Christopher Michael Jackson. And, uh, Christopher Michael Jackson? Christopher Michael Jackson? Probably no relation. No, if I did, I'd have a little more money. <laughs> <laughs> if he did, he wouldn't be here. <laughs> Tell me what's been going on. Well, I've just finished uh, working on a film. I've, uh, I write my own scripts, and I've been trying to get a little small, independent film going. Uh, I do what's, a little... the, what's the film about? Uh, the film's about a guy who grew up and with a childhood friend, and one became a cop, and the other one kind of ended up on the other side of the law. So I wrote that, and I'm trying to cast for that now. And I do a little martial arts choreography, uh, fitness instruction. Ah, see if you can break this guy behind you in half. Uh, <laughs> I'm kidding. What else going on? You live in? Uh, where do you live? I live in Inglewood. Yeah. I live in Inglewood, and uh, how's that doing? It's nice. It's nice. It's nice out there. It's quiet. Uh, the people are nice. Uh, it's just a nice place to be. Well, listen. Thanks for taking the time, Thank you. huh? Thank you. Yeah. Hey, hey, man. What's going on? Good. How you doing? <laughs> Tell it to me. Hi, Filson. And um, just basically going on a lot of auditions. Yeah, yeah. And uh, I just did a movie, Just Between Friends. I played a, um, a physical therapist. And um, we were just like, really wrapped that up really well. And I really enjoyed playing a doctor. That was like, that's the only time my mother would see me in a doctor uniform. I want to play one for real in an office, take some of that money home. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you like doctors? Well, just something that a doctor or a lawyer, something that my parents would be proud of me doing instead of trying to be an actor, you know, and a dancer. You know, I love videos. I love music videos. Can mom say my son the doctor? My son the lawyer. Hopefully after she see that film, she'll say that, you know. That's great, isn't it? But um, also I'm trying to get into these music videos. I love to dance. You know, I was dancing before I was walking. You know, um, that's what my grandmother told me that I was dancing before I was walking, you know. She was probably the one that had to chase after you sometimes. Right, okay, so I'm trying to get into these music videos. I love to dance and just trying to get my career going. And, you know, it sounds like it's happening up. This is it. This is right where it is, Hollywood. And I love being here, you know. <laughs> You're one of few. <laughs> Take care. Gordy. 
Is there a story with this or what? I want to apologize to all my fight fans. <laughs> Cause they, and you should. They think if this happened to me on my last fight, <laughs> it's, it didn't happen. It's a growth. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Are you going to work that into the acting, uh, put it on the portfolio? Or? Well, actually, I want to tell you, pound for pound, I'm, I'm considered with uh, Sugar Ray Leonard, uh, Thomas Hearns, and Gary Ali, Muhammad Ali. Uh, considered in what way, Gordy? Uh, Lee Trevino, all those great fighters. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was wondering. That they're all sports figures? <laughs> oh, uh, pound for pound, I'm, I'm considered one of them. I'm one of the best. Um, yeah. This is a great fundraiser. <laughs> Who's fun? <laughs> oh, man, I'm having so, a good time. So are you getting ready for a fight? Uh, actually, I'm training and uh, I'm getting ready for... Uh, uh, you got to wait for this to heal, of course, first. But, yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> no, no, just going to go right into it? No need to, no need to. Just... Uh, just uh, actually, it's a growth, and the uh, doctor says I'll be okay, and I can do my thing. Do you guys have any more champagne? We're all out. We never got any. <laughs> well, where did it all go, Catherine? I don't know. I mean, uh, you know, I like champagne. Someone a lot. take charge of Catherine. So, uh, now, tell me, what's your name again? Yeah, I, I'm Tony. Corey. <laughs> okay, you, you remember me? Okay, it was, it was just before that last fight. Remember, we were best friends. <laughs> okay, Terry. <laughs> okay, it, it, it'll, it'll all come back to you. Anyway, listen, take care, okay? Okay, it's a pleasure seeing you Do the you fight. Again. Do All the right. fight, man. I look forward to seeing right. you there. Hey, Irasta. Baby. Boy. Yeah, what's... What? <laughs> Irasta in the house. What's up? Oh, How's the band going? Narrow posse. You know, we're just in full effect. Oh. Going up from the bottom to the top, to the top to the bottom. Oh. How's it going? Great. Where are you playing? Well, we're going to be doing a little couple of neighborhood clubs and... Maybe a couple of talent shows just to get our name out there, a little publicity, you know, stuff we like that. We got the cassette, that. right? Exactly. Yeah. yeah so but things are things. Yeah, things are beginning to happen. Get a record deal. Oh yeah. Oh what yeah. What do you think of this? Definitely. What's the sound like? Sounds like uh, Gondonero. Yeah. Yeah. Gondonero. L.A. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Okay. See you guys later. Hey, young lady. Hey, young lady. Hi. What's up? Good. How are you doing? You doing some singing around town? Yeah. Where? Oh. I heard you were at A&M for a while. Yeah. Not no more. Things change. Yeah, things change. What do you think of this music here? Oh, this is really groovy. What kind of music do you like to sing? If you had your brothers here, where would you be right now? All right. We'll watch for you on an album, huh? Yeah. Hey, 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 Slate Forum. Slate Forum here. Oh, your name? Oh, Marie Jackson. Very nice. Okay. So, 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 so. Hey, Rasta, what you doing, man? Yeah, we got the number one song once again. You got the album, then? You got the CD? Yeah, we're ready. Full effect. We're ready for the number one song. What would you release off that if you had your druthers here? The, uh, what? Pushing in your face? Cop? What? Well, it says no police. Basically, it means that police are human like we are. You know what I mean? And without their gun and badge, they simply are people like we are. So, with them up under their law instructed, up under their badge, they feel like they're more furious. They're more like an animal in rage, and uh, we just basically don't like it and won't condone it. And we hope that soon one day the police will be people again. No police, no police in the society. Let's be regular people all over again. You know, Rastafari, right, the truth. Rasta love. Uh, all right, jump in. Tell it. Gilly, gilly, G. This is Gundy Nero Posse. You Rasta get a dread, basically. Yo, a little bit of everybody here. Yeah. What's going on? Well, we're just trying to come out and kind of make it, you know, we're going to a couple of clubs, rock a couple of clubs, let the people see how we're doing. Are you going to, do you have any dates coming up? Well, um, May 5th, we're supposed to do a little um, party, a little club, small club. Uh, you want to plug it, plug it, plug it. Yeah, so everything should work out fine with that. You want, you want to tell us where? Well, I don't have the address with me. Oh, no. Well, maybe we get it later, huh? But you got a date? <laughs> you got in the back pocket? You got the address with me. All right, let's take a look. 
Entertainment presents Ultimate Break Talent Show Comedy, Dance, and Rapping May 5th, 1993 To complete the show Okay It's gonna be on Chester Washington Club Good Alright I do the 20th in um, Washington Oh good Alright So Good luck So Can I pull you away? Hi. Hi. How you doing? All right. Okay. Slate form. I'm just basically here to get down. Slate form, slate form. Tell them your name. I am Liza Violet Jackson. Yes. What's going on? Tell me about the group. Oh, it's beautiful. It's a very good group. Very nice. Good music. Fun. Where you guys been playing thus far? Oh, just basically everywhere. Everywhere? <laughs> Almost everywhere. You name it, we've been there. Honey. From the mountains to the sea, all of Southern California. All of it. All right. <laughs> Tell me what what uh, what you want to be doing a year from now. Oh, honey, just getting down. <laughs> she may be here a year from now, doing the very same thing. <laughs> All right. Did I miss to talking to anybody? I don't think so. I'm Tony Lynn. This has been the casting party. We're going to get down. <laughs> Thanks a lot for watching the casting channel. We will see you next time. Take care.